Okay, you got to do your intro. What's your intro? There it is. All right, so where are we at? Wichita Falls, Texas. Wichita Falls, Texas. But this, this is gorgeous ass. Yeah, where are Wichita Falls? Uh, well, Lake Wichita. Yeah, Wichita. And we'll do more stuff out here, but what did we find here? Looks to me like a ritual plate somebody busted. Yeah. Ah, puppy is in the way as always. So what, uh, what we're attempting to do here is we are going to collect as much of this plate as we can, try to put it back together to find out what the fuck it's all about. It's written on both sides. This side isn't. Right, so we got to try to pick up as much as we can because we don't know yeah. what pieces go where yet. Pup's like, fuck it, I don't give a shit about the ritual plate. So maybe we could like undo the spell or whatever, right? We'll put the plate back together. Come on, if you wanna, oh, watch out, he's behind you. Good. Come on, I like your butt. Puppy's very disinterested. Yeah, it's not a pass. No. Well, I'm going to sniff your ass here in a little while. Look, he's even got his back turned to us. He's like, what the hell are you people thinking? And, this is going to take a while. Yeah, we've got this mound here. I want to investigate that a little further. Look, I mean, it's like totally flat. And then there's this huge fucking mound for reasons we don't know. Definitely glad to be out of Oklahoma. Except it's fucking hot out here. Was there a piece, right? Yeah, there's a piece. Yeah. Ouch. Maybe more of wood fighting around. Oh, that would suck. Yeah, there's some words on this one. shattered this. So what we're thinking is the idea is you, you write a, a spell, letting go. Yep. Oh, this could be interesting. Uh, you know, it might be a lost love. It might be a... I uh, think it's Wiccan. It, yeah, it's, it sounds Wiccan to me. I think it's a Wiccan ceremony. See, and there's all these little pieces here. So this would be fun to try to put together. And the camera is shaking because dumbass is not going to fucking move. He's like... Fuck you, I'm just going to sit here. Now, the minute I let go of this, of course, he'd be swimming across the lake. Just dumbass. And another piece. Oh, it's, hey, it's a better homes and garden plate. Yeah. Okay, another piece. Fortunately, my good Sony camera is pretty much fucked. It's got a loose lens inside. So, looks like it's phone video for a while. Got a lot of pieces here, hon. Oh, we got a hell of a jigsaw puzzle for later. I'm thinking this is going to be a six pack, at least. I think it might be more, but two six packs. You think it might be more? I can only go so far because he is not going to move this fat ass. Kind of right through the, the brush right here. Yeah, I see more. Is it bad luck to put together one of these? I sure hope so. Hey, we have a voodoo doll, so it'll be fine. Oh, there's a piece of writing right there. Yeah, you really like my voodoo dolls, don't you? Yeah, I like your voodoo boobs, too. <laughs> um, want to hang on to him a second? Let's see if I can find any more. Okay. 
All right. There's a piece. I know there's like five people watching this video going, what the fuck am I watching? Oh, there's a big piece right there. You watching the quality, the pressure, technique, Well, hey, this is an actual find, though. I mean, this is a good find. All right. Where? Right Some of it bounced back. Huh? Yeah. yeah. All right. I'll tell you why. Yep, it does. Uh, here, maybe I'll double bag that. We will in a second. Okay. Uh, just check it real quick. Looks like we have almost all of it. So, yeah. All right, so we're gonna double bag this, head back to the RV. Grab us some beer, find out what the fuck this thing says. All right, so what do you think? It is the Wiccan ritual of Lake Wichita, Wichita Falls, Texas. It is Wichita. Wah, wah, wah. Good thing people don't come to my channel for quality content. Let's go put this fucker back together. All right, so you done fixing yourself? What do you mean fixing myself? That's like girls and oh you're gonna take my picture, I gotta fix my hair. No. So what was the other joke? I don't remember. We're gonna fix her broken heart. No, we're picking up the pieces of a broken oh, heart. Oh, we're picking up the pieces of a broken heart. So we have a towel set out here. We're gonna try. There might be more than one plate, so we don't there know. There is. There's like two letting goes. That's the one. Oh, this is not gonna be easy. We may need some alcohol for this. And gloves. No, not yet. That's a bottom piece. Okay. Oh my God, which is top, which is bottom? Well, that's definitely bottom. It's got a knot in it. Okay, so that's definitely bottom. Of something. See? That's bottom. Where's the other part with the knot in it? There. Nope. Oh. You didn't mean to say I love you. This is going to be good. All right, it looks like we actually have two different kinds of writing. Look how bold and dense this is and how spread out this is. This is a, this is a wicked. This is definitely wicked. So, we can like. right, so there's the center rim piece. Okay, so this goes to this plate. Yeah, let's separate the pieces. Yeah. I'm not sure about that. That's nothing. Oh good, it doesn't come off. There's words like when we take the mud off that we the writing would go too. That's that plate. That's definitely that plate. See, that dense writing. That's it. Well, this is all the dense writing. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's definitely the wrong side. Hey. Okay. okay, so we've determined there are at least four different plates. We're getting there. It could be interesting. We are definitely going to need some beer. We have some other stuff to go take care of. Or we might have to go hunt for more pieces. What do you think? I'm ready. It's kind of exciting. Yeah. <laughs> but apparently it's not wicked. What is it? It's some kind of movement. Uh, women breaking plates across America, writing what they want to let go and breaking breaking it to break loose from whatever it is. See, I know it's been two months with you. I know it's not going to. For me, I feel like we took, I don't know, you were going through something, something, something. Uh, there's some weird pieces. I'm still alive, but I'm barely breathing. Oh, where did the other one go? You didn't mean to say I love you. 
It's a big piece. It's got shit on the back. Letting go. It's got the heart. She looks like the girl of my dreams. Maybe this is dudes doing this. What the hell? No. <clears throat> it could be a lesbian relationship, man. <clears throat> right? Should have hugged the internet last time I saw you. Should have hugged. What does that say? Should have hugged. Oh, look. But look, it's okay, because she's just fine. Fine. Just fine. Fine. All right, we got to go. What am I not filming that's not funny? About sexiness. Your sexiness? Yeah. Uh, so you just tried to get up, and what happened? My leg fell asleep, but I couldn't get up. <laughs> So you, all right. You're even amazing. even puppies like what the fuck. All right, come on, let's go. I can't. Get up. No, it's got the weird uh, tingly, prickly sensation right now. I can't do anything with it. I have uh, to wait until it wakes up. You have to wait till it wakes up. Yeah. Okay. Well, you ready to get started, hon? This is fucked. Yeah, you're right. This is fucked. No shit. No shit. Do you know what? I got an idea. Introducing... That's your crazy feminist tears. That's right. For the low, low price of $29.95, you too can own a genuine piece of a batshit crazy feminist broken heart. That's right. This is called letting go. You write your ideas, your problems, your your tragedies in life. And then you go to the city park and you smash that against a tree, leaving all of those razor sharp flat fragments, you know, for the children. The children need pieces of your broken heart, too. It comes in a handsome, woodish kind of frame in a non-triggering, social justice warrior-approved color. And on the back, it will be autographed by your favorite duo, Jim and Red. Well, unless Red kind of tries to stab me in the process. Act now, and you can have a genuine piece of a batshit crazy feminist broken heart. You know what, folks? Putting these back together? Well, that could be easier said than done. You didn't mean to say I love you. That's too goddamn funny. I don't want to throw this away, because it's absolutely fucking hilarious that somehow, by writing your heartbreak on a piece of glass and then smashing it in the city park for the children and the pets to find, is a good idea. I think... I am not above making a profit off of feminist freak-out heartbreak here. The pieces of their broken little hearts. Introducing the broken lesbian heart. That's right. You will get a framed fragment of the lesbian let-it-go plates. And, uh, what, it, what the back of it will have a special message written on there for you. And that message, well, I'll leave that up to Red.
Letting go is a feminist fad where you write your problems on a better homes and garden place. Then you go to the city park, smash said plate against a tree, and leave the sharp fragments for children and pets to find. Well, I think and cut their self on. Yeah, I think this is razor sharp fragments. Did you cut your? Where's your cut? Right there. See, you actually cut yourself. I, yeah, we I were. It's not big enough for me to see. Yes. Here, okay. cut yourself again so we can see it. Okay. We were trying to clean the mess up. We were trying to clean the mess of the because... razor sharp glass fragments out of the fucking city bark because <laughs> feminists have a fad. Yeah. So, what do you think? Anybody interested in buying broken pieces of the feminist heart? These little lesbian tears. Well, are they lesbians? I don't know. Maybe they're man haters. However, it will have the story on it. It will be autographed by Jim and Red. What do you For think? For limited time only. So, limited editions. If, if this is something that interests you, why don't you leave me a comment below? We will then put some of these together and list them on eBay or wherever for sale. I think this is a great product. You guys absolutely have to have this. Absolutely. Also, right. we'll be coming out with what else? T-shirties. What? New design. Do we have? Oh, yeah. Well, that we don't have that ready yet, so we shh, can't talk about that. I... Can't talk about the new T-shirts yet. We can't talk about the new t-shirt. So, since you are the star of this video, and you can, and Vanna, you can put the product down. Lord, I was trying to sell it. Yes, I definitely want to try to sell those, because those are goddamn hilarious. What is this one? Uh, this one isn't even spelled right. I love it. Uh, feeling uh, has one E, two L's. Uh, let's see, where is it? Aren't, lacks an E. But anyways... So what is your what is your uh, ending here? What would you like to say to YouTube? <sighs> you are the star here. Well, Wait. fuck YouTube and uh, fuck the advertisers. Fuck advertisers. Exactly what I was going to say. You take the words right out of my mouth. All right. Well, now eat them. <sighs> Damn. She's a psycho. Yes. Okay. Is there anything that you don't know about me? What's your bra size? <laughs> Ginormous. Big. <laughs> Elvira size. Ooh. I think you're actually bigger than Elvira. Ooh. Well, you know, boob wise. You have bigger boobs than Elvira. <laughs> I don't have bigger hair than her. All right, so this has been Letting Go with Jim and Red in Wichita Falls, Texas. That's where we are. Yeah, that's where we might be. Not for long, though. So say bye, YouTube. Bye, YouTube.